Hi everyone, it's Lynn from Halen Vintage and welcome back to another Retro Cooking Wednesday. Today, we are gonna revisit our potato chip cookies. This was when we did the cookie series that was about this time, was one of my family's favorite cookies. You can see how much Addie has grown in a year. Um, she did get her front teeth and we did have an addition. So little Ace and with that, let's get on to the video. I hope you enjoy this revisit. Thanks. Hi everyone, it's Lynn from Halen Vintage and today we're making... Potato chip! Potato chip cookies. I got my little helper here. Who are you? Addison. Addison. Oh my God. We just had parchment paper fall on the floor. So... <laughs> ghosts in the house but anyways welcome back to retro cooking wednesday okay so the ingredients that we need for our potato chip cookies is one cup it said shortening so i'm going to use one cup of butter um we needed one cup of brown sugar i made sure my brown sugar was packed one cup of granulated sugar two eggs one cup of chopped walnuts, a teaspoon of baking soda and a teaspoon of salt, two cups of flour, and then of course the star of the show, we need one cup of crushed chips. So let's get those crushed. We're getting some of our stuff blended together. Addie is going to take our potato chips in a little rolling pin and crush them for us because we need one cup of crushed. Look at her crushing those potato chips. She's doing a great job. Okay, so I do have our um, cup of butter into our KitchenAid. We're just going to whip this up to make sure that it's nice and fluffy. And then we're going to add our sugar to that once we get this whipped up. Still fresh in those potato chips. I just want to get this a little bit nice and yellow, creamy. My um, butter was out, so it was softened. It was room temperature. So I'm gonna. Sure, honey. What are you gonna tell the video? Yes, we might make popsicles today, too. Also, also. So I'm adding the two cups of sugar, the one cup of regular sugar, granulated, and the one cup of brown sugar. And we can make Snoopy popsicles and rainbow popsicles in different kinds. Really? We're going to make all those kinds of popsicles. Maybe we'll also do a right short now. video for them, huh? I think those potato chips are pretty well crushed, Miss Addie. No, they're not. All right, we got all of our sugar in here. We're gonna turn this on a little bit. We're gonna scrape down our sides. Yeah, what's left in there? Yeah, you can eat it. Okay, they're yeah. done. <laughs> they're done, Addie. No, they're not. I think she just likes whacking them with the... All right. I'm still eating I'm going to turn this back on a little bit. Making a show on what? How to make cookies! Make cookies? Ooh, she's cracking that egg. She's got it. I did it! She did it. She got the egg cracked. And there's shell in it. Oh, we don't want shell in our cookies. Get it out. Oh, I want the egg. Don't hold the egg. I don't think there's a shell in there, honey. Oh, that's just totally 
said, you got it? Oh, she got it. There was a show in there. Okay, enough with the eggs. All right. So, so, Alex, guys, this is Samson and Musty, guys. So, do not try this at home, guys. Do not try this at home? No. Okay. All right, we got our sugar and our butter mixed together. And then I need a lot of toilet paper. I'm going to add our two eggs Yo. to this. I guess Addie might be adding the two eggs to this. So she's going to dump those eggs into there, and then we're going to whip that up. Then I'm going to take her because this one did not say anything about um, sifting the flour in the soda and the salt together. So I'm just going to have Addie put this through with a whisk. Could you please just run a whisk through that? So she's just going to run a whisk through the flour um, with the soda and the salt just so that it's combined through there completely. And then we're gonna slowly start to add our flour to this. All right, let's Good add. Job, yes. When you are done whisking that, could we please add it to the sugars? To the sugar in the butter, please. Also the eggs. Yes, the eggs are also in there. All right, I think it's good. Let's start adding. Here, you can add it by the cupful into here. Yes, just add a little bit. Is that much? Yeah, you got it. You're going to spill it. You need to come up with it. Just pour it in there. Watch your... There you go. Do it that way. More? Yep, you got to add all of that. the flour? What yeah. did it taste like? <laughs> it didn't taste good? No. No? Hey, stop making my green. Hey, Mommy. Hey, Mommy. <laughs> All right. We got our flour in there. I'm going to scrape down our sides. Let me go grab the pump. So then we need to add, we will have to add our walnuts and our chips, Addie. Oh. A walnut. Wait, in this? This? You're going to, let's this? measure out, make sure we got a cup. Walnuts, get them, sample of taste. They're just potato chips, sweetie. <laughs> Add a cup, add these to here, please. You can eat the rest that's in the bag that you crushed. So she's got her cup of crushed chips uh -oh. to there. Add the walnuts, Miss Addie. Ah. All right, we got our walnuts in our chips in there. There was another recipe that said that you could, instead of, if you have somebody who is allergic to tree nuts, 
You could do like butterscotch chips. I bet you that would be really good for salty sweet. But we are going to use our walnuts this time. And I bet if these turn out really good, I might make them with the butterscotch. All right, let's scrape this down. Take this off. We're gonna mix this one time really good and then we'll come back with our pans. Have a tomato. Sure. All right, everyone. So I have my silt pad on my cookie sheet. I like to spray it a little bit um, just because I feel like it helps it brown. So I'm just going to, again, use my number 50 scoop and scoop these down on here. Addie's going to help me do that. And then we're going to take these to the oven. We're going to put them at 350 degrees for about 10 minutes. All right, everyone. Thoughts on our cookies. What can you tell them, Addie? Were they good? They were good. They so were I good. So I did I like walnuts. But they had walnuts in them and you ate them. No! <laughs> so Addie likes them my thoughts on the cookies I thought they were thin and I don't know if that's because we use shortening over the butter and also because they had baking soda and not any baking powder in the cookies so there's no acid that can actually help the cookies rise if you're just using soda so I checked both of the recipes and they only had soda in the recipes so they are a very thin cookie if you would want to make or, them a or, little bit thicker I would put baking powder also in there a little bit or you can make popsicles instead you could always make popsicles instead but with that being said this is Lynn from Halen Vintage today, and Addison today we're, making popsicles. we're gonna make popsicles now yeah. <laughs> so, have a good one everyone Bye! Stay <laughs> retro! Don't forget to like, comment, and no! subscribe! Addie, what's in your popsicles? Blueberry and pineapple and yogurt honey. Yeah? Think are they good? Yeah. They're very purple. Yeah. Then I like the whole thing. Are you happy you made popsicles with your cookies? Mm hmm Okay. Yeah, I'm happy. Say goodbye to everybody. Bye. It's good. You got your popsicles? You happy now? <laughs>